We associate amphibious landings like D-Day with modern technology and logistics, but during the Seventh Crusade, the French attempted one and succeeded. On the 5th of June 1249, King Louis IX's fleet approached the beach near Damietta. Sultan as Sali Ayyub's army lined the beach, creating a terrifying din with their kettle drums and horns. Despite the enemy's readiness, Louis overruled advice and impetuously ordered a landing. He himself jumped into the sea and waded ashore as his retainers' galleys, some large enough to have 300 rowers, rammed ashore. The men rapidly disembarked and created multiple beachheads with a hedge of shields and pikes, foiling the Egyptian cavalry's charges. Having sent urgent messages to the ailing sultan by pigeon to warn of the landing and receiving no reply, the Ayyubid defenders decided to withdraw deep inland. The French forces swarmed ashore and, rushing across a pontoon bridge that had not been destroyed, captured Damietta bloodlessly.